All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah, and double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone, and the sincere Shalom to all the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and in sincerity. I'm going on this topic, you know, about the body, you know, and basically how we supposed to be thinking in this truth, man, you know. I'm going to hit it off with this scripture, 1 Corinthians 12 and 14. For the body is not one member, but many, you know. So basically, when you come into this, man, it's not about you, man, you know. This truth is not about you, man, you know. You got guys who want glory, man, you know, vain glory. The thing is, we, we out here for, for Yahweh Basim Yahweh you know. That's, that's who, who, who it's really for, you know, who we really trying to please, you know. You got guys who, oh, it's about me, you know. I, I, nobody else can speak, you know. You got guys who, really, like I said, vainglory, man. They, 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 they don't want to do something. Because they feel like they, they they probably better than that, you know. That could that could even be a sign holder. That could even be holding the camera. That could be anything, man. You know? But it says the body is not one member but many. You know, so that you coming to this is not about you, man. It says if the foot shall say, Because I am not the hand, I am not of the body, is it therefore not of the body? You know, so it don't matter if you just out there standing, you know, out there, basically. You see, the thing is, when you went, well, I'm, I'm going to use this analogy. You got uh like sports. You got guys who are called bench warmers, you know. Now, the bench warmer might not get in the game. Yeah, that's cool, you know. But that don't mean that the bench warmer... You know, the, the, the guys who, who are on the team, they could be a vet or whatever, you know. But the guys that are on the team, that don't mean that they can't, um, they're not a vital uh, part to this truth, man. You know? That don't mean that, you know, if, you, if you're just standing out there, man, you could, you could, you could, uh, you know, with, with the new fruit coming in. You can show them how it, how they should be thinking when they come in rather than trying to, you know, do it for vain glory, you know. You could you could be be a help. You know? Whatever the case may be, man, but just because you're not doing what the hand is doing and you're a foot, that don't mean that you're not a part of the body, man. It says, and if the ear shall, shall, I mean, and if the ear shall say, because I am not the eye, I am not of the body. Is it therefore not of the body? So, if you if you got this the 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 thing of you know just being out there, man, you know holding post, man, you know, and 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 let's say you ain't reading, you want to be a reader. Hey man, you you need the the, the that's not the, the the right spirit that you need to be in, man. You know, cause y'all about some y'all shy sees everything. You know, and if and if you're not in the right spirit, you're gonna get up out of there. That's simple as is is that's plain and simple, man. It says if the whole body were an eye, where were the hearing? If you got a whole camp full of nothing but speakers, man, you know nobody want to be a reader. A reader or a sign holder or, or, or man in the camera, you know, where, where the edification going to be at, man? You know, it says if the whole, if the whole were hearing, where were the smelling? You know, so you can't come into this and, and think, oh, I want to be this. I want to be that. You know, you see, you got a You got a lot, man. And, and you need to. To be in that lot, man. Stop, stop trying to be more than what you are or, or thinking that it's all about you, man, because it's not about you at all, man. It's about your how about some y'all side. It says, but now have the most high set the members, every one of them, in the body as he, I mean, as have pleased him. You know? 
So whatever, whatever, wherever you at, man, y'all about some y'all side put you there, man. Is it pleases him, man? Cause that's who, like I said, that's who we really should be trying to please. Y'all about some y'all side, you know. So another another thing is, if you think that you should be a point guard. But the coach puts you at center. Are you going to try to be a center that's trying to push the ball? You know? Or are you going to try to do what the heck, you know, a center is supposed to do, man? If you go into one of these teams or, or go into Esau's army, I'm going to say one of the teams first, you know, and you and you, you want to be a center. I mean, you want to be a point guard. You want to shoot the, You want to shoot the ball all the time. You know, and you don't do what the coach say to do. Guess what? You're gonna get released, man. And and and, and that's from uh uh, uh from a, a, a earthly uh, viewpoint, man. So if you could get released from a team, how much more can you get released from this this truth, man? From what you know, from Yahweh by Shem Yahshua releasing you, man. You know. So, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna jump down to the 27th verse. It says, "Now ye are the body of Yahweh Shah, and members in particular. You know, so whatever whatever office you have, man, you need to you need to be be uh, take it, man, and run with it, man. Everybody isn't a, a speaker. Everybody isn't a prophet. Everybody is, isn't a reader. Everybody isn't a teacher. You know, we all we all." Got something that is that is beautiful, man. When when you come into this truth, man, you know you see you see even be proud that you know happy, as to say that you got called out that 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 past that you got called out of, man. Cause it's all vomit, man. You got guys who come into this truth and they wanna they wanna stockpile wickedness over the truth, man. Coming into this truth with a worldly spirit, you know. So it's a spiritual thing, man. But um I'm gonna jump to this this verse, Second Corinthians four and eight. For we I mean we are troubled on every side, yet not distressed. We are perplexed perplexed, but not in despair, persecuted but not forsaken, cast down and not destroyed, always bearing about in the body the dying of the Lord Yahweh Sah. You know, so when we come out there, like I said, man, this is what we really supposed to be about, man. We are the body, and we it's all supposed to be for edification of Yahweh Sah. Or, or not the edification for Yahweh Sah, but we supposed to be edifying the hope for elect about Yahweh Sah, man. You know, and, and, and the truth, man. It says that the life also of Yahweh Sah might be made manifest in our body. You know, presenting ourselves as, as, as a living sacrifice, man. So, so us, you know, different camps and stuff like that, you know, that 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 we are supposed to be just following that 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 example, man. That Yahweh Shah's life and his death isn't in vain, man. Us as the body, we supposed to, you know, be doing that, man. It says, "For we which live are always delivered unto death for Yahweh Shah's sake." Some people don't want to die for Yahweh's sake, man. That that shows that they don't have faith, man. That the life also of Yahweh's side might be made manifest in our mortal flesh. So then, death worketh in us, but life in you. So, like I said, it don't matter if you out there, uh, you know, you probably a big big guy, you know, just look look muscular or whatever. You holding post, man. You know. Those guys probably ain't gonna mess with you, man. You know, you gotta do, you gotta follow those orders, and and and, and it's really coming from y'all about some y'all side, man. It says we are troubled on every side, man. So, like, if you hold and post, man, don't you know, you're not gonna, you're not gonna be distressed, man, because we doing it for for you know, y'all about some y'all side. It's not gonna allow you to get hurt, man, or get or suffer you past what you what you able to be tempted, you know. I'm just roughly paraphrasing it, you know. So with us being the body, man, we supposed to be in the right spirit, man. 
And that's the spirit of Yahweh Shai, man. And what did Yahweh Shai do, man? We'll go to this, this, this verse. This is John 13 and 5. After that, he poured water into a basin and began to wash the disciples' feet and to wipe them with the towel wherewith he was girded. Then cometh he to Simon Peter, and Peter saith unto him, Lord, dost thou wash my feet? You know? So that shows you what, hold on, first off. That shows you what type of, uh, 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 you know, what type of spirit Yahweh Shah was in, man. You know? The king of all kings, lord of lords, man. Washing his disciples' feet, man. That's a very humble thing, man. But when he when he got to, to, to Peter, what did Peter say, man? He says, uh, Lord, does thou wash my feet? Yahweh Shah answered and said unto him, What I do thou knowest not now, but thou shalt know here, hereafter. Peter said unto him, Thou shalt never wash my feet. You know, and I'm pretty sure that Peter probably was in the in the spirit of, hey man, always doing and always, you know, hey Yahweh Shai, you know, you 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 the Lord of Lords, man. Don't you know you're not supposed to be washing my feet, you know? I'm supposed to be washing your feet, man. You know, but sometimes you you, you gotta allow a brother to be a brother, man. It's not about you, man. You know, it's all about Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Shai, man. You know, we're not greater than the servant is not greater than the master, man. And if the, 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 the master is washing his servant's feet, man, how humble do you have to be, man? You know, it says, thou shalt never wash my feet. Yahweh Shai answered him, if I wash you not, thou has no part of me. Simon Peter saith unto him, Lord, not my feet only, but also my hands and my head, you know. So, so he, you see how he could quickly change that up? You know? It says, Yahweh Shai said unto him, He that is washed needeth not save to wash his feet, but is clean every whit. And ye are, you are clean, but not all. You know? So you got a lot of people who out here who think that it's all about them, man. You know? And the reason why he said that, the next verse it says, For he knew... Who should betray him? Therefore, he said, "Ye are not all clean." You know, you got a lot of guys, man, who don't got that clean spirit, man. They didn't wash that worldly spirit off of them, man. And when you come into this truth, man, you need to wash that that worldly spirit off of you, man. You know, because you you are, you are in danger of that thermonuclear dis, dis, destruction, man. You know, if you're not a part of this body, if you're not trying to be a part of this fold, you know. You 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 you're gonna get casted out, man. It's not from it's not from uh the from from man, it's from y'all by some y'all side, man. You know? So like I said, man, we all it's all it's all for edifying of the elect, man. It says we are body we are the body of Christ and I mean bodies of Yahweh Shah, you know, and members in particular. You know? So so if 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 the coach want to put a center, or who you think might be a center, at at wide receiver, you know, or you you know you, who are you to say that that that's that's wrong, man? You could be a a a, 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 a center trying to be a wide receiver, man. You know, but do you got the job to to get to get it done, man? And at the end of the day, man, we all get the same reward. You know, so so guys coming into this thing, man. All this stuff over here is gonna get wiped away, man. It's all gonna get blasted away, man. You know, don't nobody want to want this vain glory, man. And the kingdom will get that glory, you know. And we'll, you know, it's all about your house by some y'all side at the end of the day, man. And that's the main point. And I'm not going. I, I already, you know, basically killed the topic, man. You know. But I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to y'all by some y'all side. Double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone and the sincere Salawan to all the I came out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and in sincerity. Salawan.